my boys. My boys. Two of my boys at least. Hey guys, Jessica here, and I am in my cat room today because I'm talking about my favorite products for my cats that I purchased in 2021. And these are gonna kind of span, like, I really narrowed this down just like I did with the dog products. So I, I had to buy a lot for my cats this year because we moved. And so I really, really did narrow this down. I'm gonna stick with me because these are my favorite, favorite products that I have purchased for my cats, for my cat room in 2021. And I actually didn't include these, um, but I I will. Let's, let's just go ahead and say, these are a bonus. These wall stairs for my cats, ooh, are some really, really cool pieces. If you have the space that will really get, it gives your cats a lot of vertical space. So I wasn't even in, intending to put that in today's video, but we're here. so. I'm gonna put that in today's video. Everything I talk about today will be linked in the description below. Okay, so let's start with my number one favorite thing, and it is these ruggable rugs. So I started out, I knew I wanted a ruggable rug in my cat room because previously I would be buying rugs like every year to 18 months and replacing them because I just couldn't get them clean enough. Even though I have a carpet cleaner and I would use the carpet cleaner on them, I just couldn't get them clean enough. They wore out really quickly. I cannot tell you how much I love these ruggable rugs. The first one I got was for my cat room and now we have six of them. And let me tell you, if you are worried or concerned at all that you're not gonna be able to manage it, you're not gonna be able to get it down. So yeah, it is easier if you, there are two of you, but I have done it on my own more than once because every time I pull this carpeting up, I, I throw it in the washing machine, I get it washed, I throw it in the dryer, I get it dry, and I need to lay it back out. I've done it by myself multiple times already. And let me tell you, I have not noticed any fading in the color or anything. So really cannot, cannot recommend ruggable rugs to pet parents anymore. They, are, they have made a, a huge difference in my cat room specifically, but in my whole house. Okay, my next favorite purchase is gonna be these two ounce containers, and I'm gonna show you them in the, uh, the overlay clips. So I was looking for containers that I could just store extra wet food in that maybe my cats didn't finish eating, or and now that two of my cats have decided they'll eat some raw food, the small batch, the circular little minis, fit perfectly in these two out. They're actually for baby food, like if you make your own baby food at home. But let me tell you, as pet parents, we have to find things that work for us and maybe they weren't meant to work that way, but they just do. So these are actually baby food containers, like if you make your own baby food at home, but they work perfectly for excess cat food that I need to put in the refrigerator. I don't wanna store things in plastics and metals because that stuff leaches into their food. So glass is what I was going for. They are a good price point. You get a good number of them. And like I said, everything will be linked in the description below. Okay, so as you can see behind me, we have a number of cat trees. The very, the tallest one is the one that I recommend the most. However, I, I like them all. Every one that I bought this year, I'm really happy with. I will link every one of them below, but the tall one is the one that I really want you to pay attention to because cats really like vertical space. So the way this one is designed, it, it has the most sturdy construction of any one that I've ever purchased in the past. It is solid wood, so it is heavy, and my cats absolutely love it. It is the one they use the most, and yeah, I just, this is this is my favorite, so this is the one that I'm recommending. All right, you guys, so if you can see behind me, I have a lot of canned food for my cats stored. I have a lot of freeze-dried raw food stored elsewhere, um, raw food in, in the freezer, so they have a lot of variety in what they eat. Hey, buddy. And if you have not heard of hunting feeders for cats, let me tell you, these are amazing. There are hunting feeders for wet food. There are hunting feeders for dry food or freeze-dried food if, or treats uh, I like to use them for. So these are wonderful. They help give your cat enrichment. They help stimulate them. They help, um, you know, cats are naturally hunters. So they, they give a little sense of wild <laughs> back to your cats and 
really, they're just incredible to give your cat something to do, right? And if we think about it, cats, just as much as dogs, like to earn their food, right? Because when they are out in the wild and they're hunting their prey, the actually getting to eat is the reward for hunting. So these hunting feeders, I have um, some from Doc and Phoebe. So again, everything will be linked in the description below. And I know I have put these in a video before, but really, I, I mean, if you have a cat, you need these, in, like your cat needs them in their lives. Whether you get one or more, I, I, I recommend having more because, you know, I don't like to wash constantly. I would do wash constantly, but you know, it is what it is. I have multiple cats. So get, get the wet feeders and get the um, dry feeders, which I like for treats, or also you can do some freeze dried raw in there as well. And it's just incredible. My cats love them. Sometimes, I mean, you're gonna have to get them to work at it at first, but the better your cat gets at it, the more you can hide them in different places and it's just wonderful. Okay, so you know I can't do a product video without mentioning Animalio. Hands down, the best veterinary grade, they are the only veterinary grade essential oils, but in my opinion, the best essential oils ever. I actually just, last night, the night before I, I recorded this video for you today, I took a video and I'll insert it here of Romeo. I put some of the strength blend in the diffuser, turned it on, Romeo got up right here, right back here, <laughs> um, because there's my diffuser. He got right back here in this little cardboard box and laid down right next to the diffuser and was just enjoying the diffusion. Let me tell you, when you find the right blends that your cats just know, they instinctively know they need the benefits of this aromatherapy, they will flock to it. And I have seen this on many occasions. So Animalio is the only brand of essential oils that I ever recommend for pets and for just households with pets in general, even if you're looking for essential oils for human animals. <laughs> so I, you know, if you've been following me for any length of time, you already know how much I love Animalio and I couldn't do this video without including them because they are, at, even though, again, I make, this is not a sponsored video. Um, lately, I have not done any, I haven't done any sponsored videos in almost more than, I don't know, six, eight months. So this just this is not sponsored by any brand or company that I put in this video these are things that I absolutely love and that I recommend just because I love them and not because I make any money off of it because I don't but you know with Animalio I don't make any money um, sure if you use one of my Amazon links I'll get a very very teeny tiny kickback from Amazon but that's about it. These are products I actually use and actually love so know that anything that I tell you in a video to use or to love or to try out with your pets, it is because I use it and I love it. All right guys, and I have a bonus for you because I just, hello Kimberly. Are you gonna come tell everybody about the bonus? Kimberly wants to come tell you about the bonus. I just came out with a new line of pet parent merch. It is only for the most dedicated of pet parents, which I know you are because you're watching this video. So check everything out in the description below. Make sure you go check out the merch. Listen, my cat designs so far are my favorite. So if you are a cat mom, you definitely need to check these out. But listen, even if you're buying these for friends or family that have pets, if you have a pet lover in your life, order now. That way you can get it in time for the hol holidays because they are print on demand, so it will take a little while, a couple of weeks probably, <laughs> to ship to you. But get it in time for the holidays, get it as a gift for that pet parent in your life that you know would just, let, I mean, if you have anybody in your life like me, they are gonna want <laughs> one of these t-shirts or sweatshirts, even a tote bag or a sticker, whatever you think they would love the most, go ahead and grab it for them. Also, also, if you are going to purchase the merch, I definitely recommend you join the family over on Patreon first. Why? Because if you join the family over on Patreon, it's the first link in the description, uh, you can join for as little as a dollar a month. First of all, it helps support this channel. It helps me to bring you guys great content. It's, it supports the podcast. And also, it gets you behind the scenes access, extra content that I don't put anywhere else, and 
an incredible discount code to the merch store. So make sure you join the family over on Patreon, then go check out the merch. I hope you enjoyed this video and all of the wonderful products that I put together for you because these truly are some of my very, very favorite things ever for my cats and my cat room. So with that, I'm gonna go ahead and end today's video. I hope you have a wonderful holiday season. Make sure to spoil your pets rotten because I would. <laughs> Give them extra love from me and I'll see you next time. Bye guys. Hey, thanks for watching. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel so you never miss another video.